exercise. So Joanna, maybe a couple of jump jacks and push-ups to get started. All right, team. Squat, grab that weight. Curl, press. Good. Switch sides. Squat, curl, press. Tummy tight in that squat, everybody. Okay, so I'm going to show you from the side. So remember to keep a long spine. So that low back is flat. Curl, press. Good work. Come on. Squat, curl, press. Woo! Good. Squat, curl, press. All right. We got one more. Nice work. Long spine, hips low. Ready, and rest. Rest, rest, rest. All right, team. Already sweating up a storm over here. Good work. All right. Come back to your split squat. One leg forward, one leg back. Four, three, two, one. Begin. Here I am. Split squat. Exhale up. Good. So, Joanna, you can watch what we're up to. Join us in the next set. Good. Squat down, chop up. Good. Woo! Tummy is tight. Three, two, one. Switch legs. Good. And keep those shoulders over the hips, knee close to the floor. Good. Keep looking up. So we've got those shoulders up. Three, two, one. Rest. All right. Oh, we're going to use this again. Awesome. All right. Round two of three with our um, squat curl press. Ready, set, let's squat. Now get those hips back, curl press up. You can use the momentum of the legs that stand up to help you with the curl and the press. So it becomes more like one move. Good. Chest up, hips down. Great. Good, Michelle. All right, Joanna, nice. Ten seconds remaining. Full body exercise. So finding that heart rate up. Four, three, two, one. Rest. Take a breather. And then we're going to go one more time through. All right, now, team, we're going to go all the way through everything again today. One more time at the end just so you know, okay? So don't be defeated when you get there. Last time through, split squats in three, two, one, be good. One leg forward, one leg down, across, and down. Tummy is tight, supporting that back. Squeeze those glutes. Knee gets low. Last one here, switch sides, switch legs. Good, now you may be getting tired. That's great, focus on your form. Go slower, do it better. Slow it down. Good, Michelle. Nice, Marty. Three, two, one, rest. All right, heart rates are high. Coming back one more time for the snatch. That's our squat curl press. Here we go. Three, two, begin. Reach, curl press. Good. Set those hips way back, long spine. Good. Love it, Kinsey. Awesome. With that momentum getting up. Good. Joanna, same. Nice work. Accelerate standing up, team. <sighs> Exhale it up. Nice and quick. Here we go. Final 10 seconds. Hips way back. Woo! Three, two, one. Rest. I'm going to get a drop it like it's hot. Hello, 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 everybody. Fantastic work. Grab yourself a drink, towel it off. I'm going to be turning my fan on. All 
All right, I got some air moving, got the window open. Welcome to Friday morning. Now we have four full um, rounds. So we're starting round two, checking it out. We want to have two weights this time, two weights. So I'm able to take it down just a hair. All right, since I lifted yesterday. Okay, single leg. Now we did this last week, I believe. We're gonna come into a single leg hinge, also known as a Romanian deadlift. We're gonna single leg and then alternate rowing. So I'm adding stability, all right? So we're challenging your stability. So hips come back, shoulders are back, long spine. Lean to one leg, one leg will come back. Doesn't need to be crazy far. And then we're gonna alternate one, two, just rowing up to your belly button and back down. We'll do six and then we'll stand up and we'll switch legs Then we'll do six more, okay? Six, five, yep, just like that. Okay, take a little break, am I freezing? I see some of you, you're like, ah, can't see. All right, we'll get there. Second one is gonna be our curl, biceps curl overhead press. Curl, press, come all the way back down. No legs on this one. However, hey, if your upper going overhead doesn't feel good today, I want you to do that curl and then outside to the side raise. Okay, so curl and then a raise. Go ahead. Do that curl and raise. All right, all right, welcome back, welcome back. We will get started with our big row. Grab those weights, we go. Three, two, one, be good. So single leg, one, three, we're rowing, four, five, six. Stand it on up, switch sides. Hinge, single leg, six, Five, four, three, two, one. Stand it on up, switch legs. We got 10 seconds to go. So three, two, one. Stand it up. Start on the other leg next time. Let's rest. Okay, so I did two on the left leg. Next time I'll do two on the right leg. Woo! Go ahead and grab those weights because we're going overhead in three, two, one. Be good. Curl, press, bring it all the way back down. Good. Woo! All the way down, let's go. Curl, press. Okay, I'm trying with my kettlebells. A little different. Woo! Good. Now, if this gets heavy, you can always lift those heels. You need it. Okay, 20 seconds to go, we're halfway. Good, make sure we bring those hands all the way down to the side, and then lock out those elbows all the way up. Three, woo, two. And the last one. Oh, good work, good work. Good work, good work, that was a rest. Sorry, uh, no, y'all froze. <laughs> I don't know where you went. All right, coming back. All right, single leg, start on the other leg this time. In three, two, hinge, and let's row. Good, one, one, two, two, three, three, switch legs, good. And other leg, six, five, four, three, good, and switch. Woo, burn it up. Good, six, five, four, three, two, one. Stand it on up, take a break, good work. All right, so we're working stability. One leg stays stable, the other body is moving around it. So struggling to hold that core stable. Good work. All right, we're going overhead. Get ready for three, two, one. Let's curl. Curl press, 
Now, partway through this, you may get very tired and need more rest. So I want you to take more rest when you need it. Or if I see you being sloppy, I'm gonna tell you to stop. No sloppies. Woo, I'm getting tired. You're doing great. Good, mom and dad. Team, as we go overhead, let's align the elbows under the wrists. Good. Elbows under those wrists, then press it up. Nice, paying attention. Good, Kinsey. Four, three, two, one, and rest. All right. Team, I love what you're, coming, what you're doing. We've got one more round here. And if you're like me, you're starting to not feel your arms. Okay. Okay. Good work. Starting with your, whoo, one leg. All right. Hinge. Reach. And I'm going to go for the side here. So you can see, belly's tight. Six, five, four, three. Reach that heel back. And one, six, five, four. Good, Joanna. Three, two, one, and switch. Last time, six, whoo, five. Hips are back, four, three, two, one, and rest. Great job. Starting to fall over there. Whoo. So you're starting to feel in the lower body, our hamstrings and glutes as we're stabilizing our core. I'd love to give them a break now as we go into our curls and presses. All right, shaking out my legs. Here we go, three, two, and let's curl, press. All the way down, good. Curl, press. Oh, oh, oh. woo. Good. Marty, that's awesome. As we're pressing, let's press with our palms facing each other. Good. Palms facing each other. Nice. Exhale, push. We got 10 seconds to go. All right, I'm starting to fall apart. If you're falling apart, just take a rest. Michelle, that looks great. Finishing it off. Three, two, one, rest. Drop it like it's hot, everybody. Great job. Ow! So remember, we're gonna do a small trip all the way through these at the end. I know, my, I'm like, I need to drink, but I can barely pull my cup up. <laughs> mm. So yesterday in my class, we had to do push-ups to failure. And I know you know what that feels like. It feels very hard. So today, my arms are jelly. <laughs> all right. Speaking of arms being jelly, we are gonna be Rocking and rolling. I'm gonna have you grab one weight just for one time, one, one of these exercises. So we're gonna do a lateral lunge. So if I'm stepping this way, hold the weight in your other arm, okay? So opposite. So now I am going to step, lunge, bringing my opposite foot, uh, sorry, weight towards my shin or foot. And then we're gonna bring it up, curl. Whoop, try not to fall over. All right. And again, lunge, reach, and curl. Good, lunge, reach, up, and curl. So it's a little biceps curl as you push off that lunge. Then we'll switch halfway through, okay? All right, so it's a single arm move. All right, second exercise, we're going into just legs. Forward lunge, reverse lunge, switch. You can hop switch, or you can stay low and switch. And I'll adjust my mat here. So I'm in the middle of my mat. I'm just gonna go forwards, lunge. Same leg, reverse lunge, whoop. Back in the center, hop, switch. And then forward lunge, reverse lunge, and hop, switch. Or stay low and switch. So stay low and switch, okay. That is where we're going. Ooh, legs are gonna be spicy. All right, remember, as we go through today, if you need more rest, just take it. Find one weight and we'll begin. I'm gonna grab this weight. Lunging, ready? Begin. So lunge, reach, up and pull. Lunge, reach, up and pull. Show you from this side. Lunge, reach, 
up, pull. Okay, switching after this one. Up and pull, switch way, switch arms. Lunge, reach, up, pull. Reach, good, up, pull. I'm like, I need more. Reach, pull. Reach, last one, pull. Take a breather. Now I didn't talk about your feet. Your feet should be facing forwards, not to the sides. All right, here we go. Start in the middle of your space. Use those arms, forward lunge in three, two, one, let's lunge. Forward, reverse, hop switch. Forward, reverse, hop switch. Forwards, now I'll show you the stay low and switch. Stay low and switch. Forwards, reverse, stay low and switch. You need a break, just take it. Good, we got 15 seconds to go. If you wanna speed up, you go right ahead. Good, 10 seconds. That's right, those legs are burning. Three, two, one. Rest. Ooh, baby. That's right. Getting it done on that Friday morning. Now it's time to put that intention to use. Why am I here today? What's this really for? Find that weight. Ready, set, let's lunge. Toes are forwards and reach. Good. Pull. Oops. All right. So make sure those toes forwards, reach, and pull. Good. All right. Last one. And then switch sides and switch. Good. Reach. Pull. So you got a little tight core as we reach. Keep that spine long. Toes are forward. Good, Michelle. Great, Joanna. Last one, team. And rest. Woo. Pulling across the body, working our core from the front to the back. Well done. Oh, you know, kind of dreading that I put this in here. I was like, I know what would be good. Some more lunges. Today I'm not feeling it. <laughs> All right, let's go. Three, two, one, let's lunge. Land back. Woo, half switch. Good. Now, can you get that back knee down closer to the ground? Woo. Good, Kenzie. Big steps, mom. Nice. Good, dad. Woo. Joanna, looking awesome. Getting those knees down. Oh, team. I know you're feeling that burn. Let's push. For eight more seconds, we'll get a break. Woo. Three, two, one, rest. <sighs> Walk it out. I know those feelings are pretty intense right now. Those feelings of this is enough, this is good enough. <sighs> Don't listen, I want you to push one more time. Lateral lunge in three, two, let's lunge and pull. Good. Lunge, pull. Maybe you just hit the shin. Maybe you're just reaching to your knee. It's okay, because we've got that crunch. Yep, that is twisting across. Snap it up all the way to the shoulder. So we're here, snap. Good. Two, switch legs, switch arms. Reach, snap. Good, Joanna. Michelle, love it. Reach. Last one, team. And rest. All right. Getting that lunge and switch out of here. We got one more. I know. Taking some extra oxygen. Breathing a little deeper. Four, three, two. Last time through this until the very last. All right, but in this set, Stay low. All right, if you've got anything left, now is the time you're gonna pour it into the ground. Push that energy. 
when you burn this energy, you create more energy. Let's get it done on a Friday morning. Halfway. Good. If you need to shake it out, like I do, just shake it out. Keep it going. Can you use those arms? I see you. Last one, team. And rest. Sending you a high five. I feel like that was the hardest one. Nice work. Woo! Okay. We have one final round. Fourth and final. We're going to start with a push press. All right. So even though you're probably using the same weight, our arms are tired. So we will use our lower body to hoist that weight just above our head. How we do that is a little push from our heels. You don't leave the ground, okay? Feet hip width apart, knees soft, hands at your collarbone. All right, and then right here, we're gonna exhale, push with those heels and start that movement overhead. So you're really, getting under the weight and pushing it up that last half. But that first half is from the toes, the heels, the hips. So push press. If that still feels too awkward, that's okay. Just do that overhead press, but make sure we are not sloppy. No injuries. Okay. Second exercise, you're just gonna take a one weight, make it a lighter one if you can. And we're coming back to one last Split squat. So feet will be hip width apart. One is forward, one is back. We're gonna hold as we get that twist. So core twist, belly tight, twist, twist. All right, maybe you just twist, maybe you add a little bit more with the shoulders, okay? So this is all up to you. Keep it tight and don't over twist, all right? Listen to your body. At halfway through, we will switch sides, okay? So when we keep those um, hips in a squat, split squat, that keeps our hips level. So we're not at risk of really injuring that low back, but I don't want to over torque anything, okay? So take it slow if you need to. Woo, here we go. One last thing is if overhead is not feeling good, go back to the side raises. You might see me there. Okay, here we go. Hands on those weights, getting ready for four, three, two. Let's begin, exhale, push. Good, push press, woo, good. Make sure those knees are soft, tummy is, well, tailbone is tucked. Show you from the side. So, yes, that protects our lower back, keeps our core stacked, so we're not leaning. Good, woo, nice. I gotta take a rest, all right. We got eight seconds to go. So you're gonna get one last one. Three, two, one, and rest. Fantastic. Fantastic. All right, all right, all right. Here we go. Grabbing one weight, split squat. So feet hip width apart. One's forward, one is back. That back heel stays lifted. Tummy is tight, back knee is down. Let's hold and twist. Shoulders around the spine. Good, so shoulders are stacked right over those hips. Let me show you. Nice and tall. Yes, I know this is hard. Come on, push three, two, one. Switch legs. Oh, here we go, round two. Low, stack those shoulders. Good. Burning up. Come on. Good, Joanna. Twisting those shoulders, twisting that chest for three, two, one. Ouch. Those are my legs screaming. Good work. Okay. Team, we're in our last two in this set. Find in that weight. Bring it to the collarbones. Ready? And let's push press. Over high. Good. Soft knees. Lift from those heels. Woo. 
and make sure that those, um, what's the word? Knuckles are lifting to the ceiling. Knuckles to the ceiling. Good. So we're not twisting those wrists. Knuckles straight to the ceiling. Good. Four. Woo! Three. Good, Joanna. Two. Go, Michelle. One. And rest. Can't see that was great. Mom and Dad, awesome job. Everybody giving their all right here. Yep. <laughs> all right. Find my lighter weight. Good. Let's focus. Shoulders up. Solid twist. Three, two, one. Get low. Let's twist. Good. Tummy tight. Twist in those shoulders. Good. Keeping this head stable. We're just twisting around it. Three, two, one. Stand and switch. Coming low. Burn it up, baby. That's right. That's life right there. Feeling that burn. Creating that energy. Three, two, and one. Rest. I'm laughing because I'm trying to avoid more sweat in my eyes. Put my head up. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. We got one to go. So. Okay, I'm grabbing my lighter weights. Push press, ready. Yeah, get set. Let's push. One last time. One last time. Good, so again. Knees are bent, okay? Tuck that tailbone, protect that low back. Turn on your abs. I know we're working the arms, but those abs are working too. Core stays strong. Whew. Woo! Squeeze that tush. We got 10 seconds to go. Good, four, three, two, rest. Fantastic. I saw people picking up the pace at the end. Well done. Getting it all out. All right. Take it on more oxygen. Trying to get through. One more. Split squat with our twist. Four, three, two, Ooh, one. Keep that rear heel lifted. Here we go. Great, Kinsey. Good, keep it tight. It's okay if it's slow. Yep. Four, three, two, one, switch. Back heel stays lifted. I know we're working hard. Come on. Good. Twisting the shoulders, the chest. I'm gonna pick it up and make it a little shorter. Feel those core stability in the hips. Legs are screaming, two, one, they're done. Woo! Send you a high five out here, everybody. High fives. All right. Now I know you're quivering in fear because I did say we're doing one more round, but we're doing it in the Tabata style. So only 20 seconds, only 20 seconds of work. And some of those will be split in half because they're one side and then the other, right? Take a drink, calm down, bring your heart rate down as we get ready. All right, have all the weights. I have five weights over here ready for me. Have your weights ready. We will start with our split squat chop. Then we're gonna go to our um, sing squat curl press. So split, squat, chop. The thing about our 20 second effort is that there's only 10 seconds of rest. So it's a fast switch. Fortunately, you're not getting on the ground. So, okay. We're gonna bring this, find your one weight to get started. Let me adjust my timer and we'll get rocking and rolling. On your final 20 second effort, you're just at your best. If you feel like you need to slow down and go slow, great. Focus on your form. If you're ready to blast off into space, go all in, do that. Here we go. Split squat and chop. Let's go. 
down and chop. Woo! And chop. Whoa! And chop. Last one, switch. Good. Other side. Down, chop. Woo! I know my legs are screaming. Three, two, one. Rest. Good. Now we're going to take this to the ground. Okay. Ready, set, let's get low. Squat, curl, press. Good. Switch arms. Squat, curl, press. Good, Dad. Squat. Curl. Make sure we're standing. All right. Three, two, one. Rest. Woo! Find both weights. We're going to do the single leg. Yep, single leg. Ready? Begin. So we're hinge. Row two, three, four, five, six. Switch legs and row. Six, five, four, three, two, one, and rest. Hold your weights because we're doing curl, overhead press, or to the side. Overhead doesn't feel good. Four, three, two, begin. Curl, press, and down. Curl, press. Woo! Great work. Make sure as we press up, those knuckles punch the ceiling. Three, two, one, rest. Drop one, um, drop one weight. We're gonna go side lunge. Good, so lunging to the side where your weight is not ready. Begin, lunge and pull. Good, cross that body, get that hip back. Tummy tight, three, two, one. Switch sides, that one went a little long, it's okay. Three, two, one, rest. Drop your weights. Forward and reverse lunge with a switch. Three, two, go. Lunge and reverse. Hop switch. Lunge, reverse. You can stay low and switch. Two. All right, all right, all right. Split squat with our twist. Three, two, one. Come on down. This is a little out of order from the way we did it. That's okay. We'll get the last one. Overhead. Woo! Three, two, switch legs. Woo! Good, 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 good. Three, two, one. Right. Find those weights. Okay, push press at the shoulders. Ready, set, let's push. Woo! -hoo. This is it. Knuckles up to the ceiling. Tummy tight, tailbone tucked. And three, two, one. Let's rest. Sending you all a huge high five out there. Woohoo! Fist bumps galore. We got balance, we got core, we did it all. <sighs> Let's come down to the ground and we're gonna finish with one short core set on your back. So meet me on the ground on your back. Go ahead and take your shoes off if you like. Okay, and what we've got is a dead bug. All right, so dead bug on your back, extending those legs towards straight, tapping the ground. But the important part is our core, that belly is tight on the ground, and then anchor your rib cage to the ground. All right, so our dead bugs for 20 seconds, then we'll get a 10 second break. Ready, 
Begin. Dead bugs. Opposite hand, opposite arm. Sorry, opposite foot, opposite arm. Squeeze that lower back to the ground. Squeeze again with your belly. Tight. Tight. Three, two, one. Rest. Now we're going to come up to a V sit. So come on up to seated. Okay. Bring your heels to touch the floor and hold. So scooping out that low belly. Now, if you'd like to, you could add one leg or both legs off the ground. You could straighten your legs for a little more challenge. Five seconds. Tummy tight. Three, two, one. Rest. All right, come all the way back to the ground. Your choice of sit up all the way up or crunch. Shoulders off the ground. Ready, begin. Sit up comes all the way up or crunch. Shoulders come off the ground. Either way, keep your chin away from your chest. Good. Four, three, two, rest. All right, team, we're gonna go right through that one last time. This is it, and then we're stretching. Dead bugs in four, three, two, begin. Reach. Lengthen the leg to make this tougher. Shorten the leg to make it easier. Tap the ground, squeeze your back. Three, two, one, rest. Doing a little circle on my back. Come on up to seated. V sit in three, two, one, begin. Get straight legs or bent legs or legs. Scoop that belly against the spine. Five, four, three, two, one, rest. And finally, our sit up or our crunch. Here we go, last time through in three, two, one, begin. Woo! Good, good. Five seconds. And rest. Woo, staying on your back. Fantastic work, everyone. Bring one knee and then the other to the chest, hands on your knees, and let's roll in a circle, one direction, like the wheels on the bus go round and round. That's what it reminds me of. And then switch directions. And release, send your left leg long to the floor. Clasp your right knee towards your chest. Release it, clasp your knee towards your right shoulder. And now take your left hand and guide your right knee across your body to the left as you keep your shoulders grounded. Stop when you feel a stretch in your back from your sacrum, through your mid-back, to your neck. Looking at your right fingers. Slowly release, switch legs. All right, so right, uh, left knee towards your chest, clasp it tight. And then release the pressure. Now left knee towards your left shoulder. A little compression, lower back, a little stretch. And then a tight compression for the hip. And release. Taking your right hand, guide your hand across your body to the right. Arm extends left. Look at your fingers. Keep your shoulders grounded. Slowly make your way back to center. Take your right ankle across your left knee and draw the left knee to the chest. We hit those legs hard today, so let's pay a little attention to them. Glute stretch here, figure four, glute stretch. And 
again, switch legs. Oh, goodness, tight. <laughs> Good, squeeze that right or left knee towards the front of the mat. Three, two, one, release. All right, let's make our way all the way back up. Just roll up. All right, and then come on up to a kneeling lunge. Double over your mat if you need to. All right, so right leg forward, left leg down. And our kneeling lunge. From here, good. We're gonna hands to your hips and then tuck your tailbone. So you really are tall, but, but just by tucking the tailbone, you feel that extra stretch across the front of your hip. Reach, good, that left arm up to the ceiling and across to the right. Bonus, you can look over your right shoulder. Big stretch all the way down towards your inner thigh. Slowly come back to center. Woo! Switch legs. Good. Tuck that tailbone. Other leg is forwards. Hands to your hips. Good. Tuck that tailbone. And good. So right arm up to the ceiling and then a reach across. Bonus, you can look over that right, uh, left shoulder. Come back to center. All right, now come to the hands and knees, and we're gonna come to a downward facing dog to stretch the back sides of our body. If that's too much for your shoulders, you can always do a seated forward fold. All right, otherwise, Curl your toes under, lift your hips up to the ceiling, pressing one heel down at a time. Shake your head no. Lift your hips up, press your heels down, feel that big stretch. Last breath here. And bring it back to the knees. And let's come to seated. Woo. Curl. You can sit cross-legged or however you like. We'll finish with a little neck stretch. So seated. Tent your right fingers to the ground. Send your left ear to your left shoulder. Optional additional tension guiding your ear to your shoulder. Now release the tension, keep your ear there, but look up towards the ceiling, just a tiny twist. Stretch in the neck. Release that twist, option to do a neck roll, chin to the chest, other side, couple more, if you like. Finishing on the opposite side. Right hand can guide your right, left, wait, no. Right hand guides the right ear to the right shoulder. I'm hearing you. <laughs> and then release that tension. Option to look up. Just turn your chin up towards the ceiling. And release. And with that, take yourself into a fabulous weekend. Oh, goodness. Thank you for coming in, bringing that energy to class today. Let's see.